Getting some serious rays there, Flip. Moon tanning, man. Full moon. You don't get them every day. No, you don't. Do you ever wonder if it's all a big con, Flip? Eh? Hey? This. Everything. What if none of it really exists? What if it's like some big experiment and we're like ants trapped in a giant Petri dish? What if there's a greater intelligence out there and it's creating everything purely as a way of stopping us going insane on them? What if nothing really exists until we sense it? My, my room doesn't exist till I walk into it. Front yard doesn't exist till I experience it. You don't exist. I don't exist. Well, you could be just a projection of my inner psyche, materialised from my brain in order to keep me company. What about the cashmere sweater babes over the road? With their swishy little skirts and all? Would they be from your inner psyche or mine? Probably yours, I reckon, Flip. Took off a while ago with some rugby types. Losers, man, forget them. Nah, we're connected, man. Once you have them by the moonlight, they never want to go back. It would mean that when we close our eyes, everything disappears. And if we open them fast enough, we might be able to catch the greater intelligence out and see that there's actually nothing there. What if I kept mine open while you shut yours? Now you're just being stupid now, Flip. It doesn't work like that. There may be some sort of delay switch happening. Tomorrow is the shortest day of the year. In pagan times, it would be time for the king to be sacrificed. And for the queen to select a new man to be her king. May I? Seems a bit rough on the poor old kings, doesn't it? It was a great honor. Their blood had to be poured into the ground to make the earth fertile again, and the harvest plentiful. Makes you sort of thankful for crop rotation, doesn't it? The female fertility cycle is 28 days. A lunar moons is 28 days. Month. No. Moon. The moon is a lunar moon. The same as a woman's fertility cycle. Thirteen moons fit exactly into one year. At the end of the thirteenth moon, the king must die. Oh, well. I guess if it helps with the harvest. <sighs> when the patriarchy took over, they abolished the 13th moon to stop the killing of the kings. That's why they say 13 is the unlucky number. Why should 13 be the unlucky number? Just because some man didn't want to be bled to death. I get very pissed off about that. Men are bastards. 